Welcome back, my friends, to another YouTube video. Today's topic will be reflection of today's events. Starting with the first thing that happened today was I found out why this person messaged me about. How I accepted the law of Thelema to be, at my core belief system. They assumed I was a Satanist, turned into Egyptian pantheon into the law of Thelema. They assumed they could find the satanic link into. The law of the lima. What happened was, they based this on an old document I wrote prior, before I woke up into the law of the lima. What happened? I was pissed that. They disrespected me by pursuing me into asking me, "Is this right or not?" Because they assumed I was a Satanist. Like, really, you pursued me to say if my religion is right or bad. Like, are you a fucking nutcase? So yeah, in the beginning, I was pissed off. Then it hit me. They said they linked it to a video I made. That video was before I was into the law of the lima. Like about a year old, or no. I made that document in 2014. When I became a full-fledged Thelemaite, like fully aware, after reading all sacred holy books of Thelema, that happened between October. Okay, two month, two month span. This was right before. I created my website. My website houses all spiritual enlightenment posts I written from my ascension after I no after maybe during and after I read all sacred holy books of Thelema. And that happened in October and November. Late November was when I created my website, and then like a week later, I created my YouTube channel for my video blogs, where I read my blog posts I have written. And that was in 2018. This. Document was in 2014. My spirit guides were telling me, "Hey, update this old document. You need to write it clearer, make it more sense." At first, I was pissed. After I found out that this. Assumption came from before I was a Thelemaite. Then it hit me: the universe was talking to me. My spirit guides were yelling at me. What happened? I laughed. <laughs> I said, "Very funny, spirit guides, for doing that to me." Very funny. 
And that is my reflection of the first event. I was pissed, and then I was laughing. After I found out that the universe was talking to me. Reflection of that. Okay, so how can the universe talk to you? It speaks to you in everything. What you see, what you hear, what you watch, what you listen to, what you read. Things do not happen by chance. You meet people for a reason, be it a lesson or a blessing, or we teach them. Keep that in mind. So yes, things do. Happen for a reason. I found out what my reason was, why that happened. In the end, I said "fuck off." In my head, I did not write that to them. Instead, I just blocked because I was not going to continue that. Conversation with a closed-minded sheep. Never push your volition onto another person. Let it be to true and divine free will. I respect you. You respect me. As it should be, and that is why I said this person. Disrespected me and had. Actually, I did not see this part. They had a hidden agenda to why they messaged me in the first place. When they actually said why they messaged me and actually came out with it, I was surprised that they actually admitted it, and I was pissed. And then I was laughing. And then I blocked Del Sarias. So yeah, do not take anyone's bullshit. Do not stoop to their low level. I rose above them, and I blocked them and ignored no conversation from that point forward. I was not going to stoop down to that level. It was a troll, and/or a robot. I don't know. That could be a thing. Reflection one, over. Reflection two. So I had a person say to me something that made me feel a little bit disappointed. Okay, I was disappointed. What happened next? I wrote that from that disappointment into a inspirational, powerful, and emotional blog post. I turned a low into a high. I flipped. The switch from low to high, from sadness into empowerment. That felt really good. At first, I was writing from, like, uh, how's it? At first, I was writing from three D. And then my higher wisdom kicked in. I went from inner wisdom to higher wisdom because, like, in when I was writing, I felt like okay, this is, I was writing from my own brain, and then I was in a trance. I transcended into. 
the the soul perspective, higher wisdom from five D, not three D anymore. That's why I kind of said said it in that way because the voice in my head、uh, changed, like from how I'm talking right now to my higher self, and I view that as. Two different type of personalities,、uh, so to speak. Because one is like on a higher, much higher vibration than what I am in now. If that makes any sense.、Uh, so basically, yeah, I went from three D to five D and back to three D, and it was awesome. I got a lot of inspirational wisdom from my higher self, and that is reflection two. Changed a low into a high, and it allowed me to see why I really do not talk to a lot of people. Hmm. Pardon me.